What's that rope for? For when I tie uh, a 180 class mule deer to my backpack. What? It might look a little funny coming back with a forky. <laughs> <laughs> That's all right though. Truck's all loaded up. Ready to go. What's your prediction? Outdoors, 2017. <laughs> Pulling in the middle gate to the bar and get some burgers and beers for us, not the driver. No, not for me. <laughs> Slash hunter. Slash hunter. And then we will be on our way to camp. Probably get there around no, 9 or 9.30. Just got camp set up. Get a new bag out of my house, probably on the truck. <laughs> it's time! Like 3.30, about to start a hike. We gotta go way to the top of the mountain. Hopefully we can make it there in two hours. We should. Stay tuned. It's been a little bit of a stressful morning. Yeah, I forgot my binos at the truck, forgot the rangefinder at the truck, forgot the GoPro at the truck. But I got my bow, got my arrows, and I got my release. That's all I need. We'll get it done. Let's get after it. Made it to the top. We're still gonna get into a glassy spot. The glassy bowls. Jeff spotted the big buck. steep and as you can see everything around here is steep so we don't know what to do. He's pretty good deer. And we're gonna wait and see and see if we can find any more bucks with him. There's our, there's two of them down there. One the three by three, pretty tall, decent. The other one's just a spike but there might be more bucks with him so See what happens. Justin, how do you feel about that deer we just found? Bueno. Bueno? Gonna get it done. Bueno. He is currently sitting way up there. So guys, this is the best buck that we have seen this trip. Um, solid four, deep forks. Just a nice, pretty deer. Be a perfect first archery buck. We're just gonna watch him tonight. See what he does. And uh, try and plan something for the morning. But we will let you know what happens.
That one is so cool. I don't think he scored very well, but he's like the most characteristic deer ever shot. I hammered him. Where'd he go? I went through the trees down there. Okay. Oh my god. Oh. Dude, all I saw was just red on his body when I saw him running. I saw it too. You got him. You got him good. I think I hit him a little back, but... I hit him here. And so I came out. He stopped. Drew back, my bubble was level, and I was like, top dog. Oh my god, we just shot a mule deer. Boom, <laughs> with a bow. <laughs> this is incredible. Oh my god. <laughs> it was him, that was the one we were watching. Yeah. I saw that patch uh, on his side when he was leaving. I thought I heard tumbling down here, I don't know. Oh my god. All right, well, should we leave? <laughs> The bow and arrows here and go up and get the boots on and grab the packs. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. I saw him stop and I was like, oh please, please stop. Please. Okay, he stopped. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh my god. We worked for this one. Oh my god. He might only be a forky. But, that was incredible. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> you did it, man. Oh my god. Alright, let's do the bow here. Maybe just sit here for a minute and see if he does pop out that other side, but I think he's dead. I think so. 20 yards, dude. I think he went down, down there. Now the fun starts. Now's when all the work starts. Where we first saw him was way up there in that saddle up there. So we gotta get get to him. Get him loaded up and four miles out to the truck. It's all right. Well he may not be the biggest, but that was a blessing. We've already hiked about 30 miles this trip, we still got another 
four or five out, but he'll be on our backs first here with a bow. I'm telling you, I can't, I couldn't be any happier. Um, that was an amazing feeling, 20 yards. May have not made the best shot, but it was awesome. Oh, yeah. was quick. You went down quick. Couldn't have asked for a better experience, really. Back here in the back country with all your best buddies, hunting deer, bow, pretty awesome. game bags brought to you by the magnum pack by caribou gear it's the elk one but you know we're deer hunting and you know sometimes you just gotta send it just gotta send it you just gotta send it your game bag so you like cut the quarter so you quarter off the of deer yeah so i know i know that i just didn't know what it was in there. Like game bags. Like game bags are. and these are only the best by caribou gear Oh, what is this? May you ask? Oh, this is the phone scope. Oh, the phone scope. Only the best in digiscoping. Yeah. Oh, you wonder why you can't see me right now? Because I'm in the best King's camo. Oh. oh, and then the Everly Stock backpack. Ooh, just the just one. You know, because if you're just gonna go, you better just have one pack. So why not have the just one by Everly Stock? And then what's this, may you ask? <laughs> Body glide. Chafing and blisters. Because you know, when you've had a long day on the mountain, you get some rubbing. Not with Body glide. Body glide cleans that shit right up. <laughs> <laughs> you should make a fucking commercial. <laughs> I know, give me a 